it's been using plasters and using different, different kinds of materials, right? To create, you know, one of a kind pieces from Mexico, is it not? It right? is. Talavera? They base it in the Sp Spanish and Mexican cultures. I, I know my stuff, Lindsay Gale. Yeah, I you know do. My stuff. Uh, <laughs> and Plow and Hearth is bringing us a version of art inspired by Talavera. This is made for your wall, indoors or outdoors? Both. Both. All for $25.34. It's on clearance. There's no reorder, and Easy Pay goes away at the end of the day on this one. A flower, a butterfly, a hummingbird. Nice to have your lens. Good to see you too. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. From Plowing Hard. Yes. Um, large, beautiful, beautiful pieces. I like these. I really do. I. Yeah, I'm sorry. No, you. I uh, know. I just love that they're a splash of color, and a, a lot of places, a lot of areas that I know in my home, I can't get that color, especially in, in a, at height. So I like that, and especially because it's all year round, Rick. We don't have to. This is great for summer, but the great thing is you can also use it all year round because it's power coated steel. Great, but good for all the elements. Good for all the elements. Mm -hmm. Well, take me through this. First of all, as you start over here, mm -hmm. what's the scale on that? Like that flower, that's 17 and three quarter by 18. That's a great size. It is really a nice size, and I just love. I love the pop. I love the color of these. That's what draws me to them originally. I love the fact that it's Talavera. You mentioned it is this based out of the Mexican Spanish cultures. It's it's typically known to be ceramic. So what Plow and Hearth does is ceramic. Yeah. Yes. And so it's very fragile and also very heavy. And you wouldn't want to put a piece of ceramic, especially it would be, it would be very hard to detach to the wall because of the weight. And you get you get you get ceramic. Hand painted Talavera. Yeah. You ain't gonna be paying twenty five dollars. No, for you that. wouldn't. But not so that same kind of scale. So this is safe to go on the wall. Safe to go on the wall. One hundred and fifty to go around. This is the one. I love the flower. This is the flower. Yeah, and I love that it has this little jewel in the beginning and in the middle here. We've got, if you can see, actually I have one in my hand here to show that there's actually dimension to this. It's mm -hmm. not just a flat piece of metal that you're gonna just like stick on a wall. There's dimension, there's 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 embossing here where all the colors change, as you can see here right. on the side. There's different layers to it. I love that it's almost an airbrush type of paint. It's not like a, like it's just, it's all hand done, but it's different. It's not your average paint like that you typically see. And next to that is our hummingbird. Mm -hmm, which is a classic. If you're a garden person, everyone loves hummingbirds. Looks like a butterfly to me. Yes, and Pretty a butterfly. butterfly. I actually like using this, Rick. I know a lot of people who can't use wreaths on a storm door or a screen door because there's not a lot of room in, in there. These are a perfect profile for a screen door or a, or a storm door. And it's great to have something different than your, your traditional wreath, something to change it up. 23 inches, by the way, our butterfly. 23 inches mm -hmm. by 14 inches. How do I actually hang it? Can you show them the back? So, yeah, here? there's a hook and loop on the back here. I'll put my finger behind so you can see it. And that's a great picture of the butterfly. There's so much detail to these. Again, if you don't know Plow and Hearth, they have been in business for over 30 years. And what they're known for is their quality. They bring you those craftsman pieces that you, you usually see at those small art fairs, but they give them to you at an amazing price, but just known for their quality. Great stuff. And there is M60802. There are your choices. Mm -hmm. We have it now for $6.34. And there it is in action. So some of the colors, that is really... Um, Massive pop of colors yes. that look at the, how the greens and those navy blues and those bright, bright reds all work together. The gold and yellows, and there you see them combined. Yeah, and I, I they're just, I love the fact. That, I mean, again, we were saying earlier, like, listen, we. We want to express our personalities in our garden. We want to have fun. We want to smile when we look in our backyard. And this is something you can put on a shed, on a fence maybe, or you're having issues, having things you know, maybe grow, or even if you can't get any height from something, something to just enjoy, smile in your backyard. Give that pop a color. You can't look at these and not smile. Can't so look at these and not, and not smile. Uh, if you'd like to do it, uh, you can pick it up here. And again, when we say Talavera, this is Talavera inspired. Yes. Tell me, I know we went over that a couple times, mm -hmm. but tell me about Plow and Hearth. So Plow and Hearth has been in business for over 30 years. They started as a catalog company uh, based out of Madison, Virginia. They're just, they, what they do is they take those craftsman pieces, they give it a little bit of whimsy, a little bit of, they just, they bring a pop of color, a pop of, of, of just personality and just make it different. They, I always say, Rick, that Gardening's a competitive sport. Like we always want to, we always want to have the best backyard, the best home. You know, we always want to impress our friends, and this, the gardening is the same thing. So let's now we've got with, with, with 150 to go around. Where are we going? Because this is outdoor living. That's the name of the show, mm -hmm. and we happen to be indoors showing these off on the wall. Three season porch, lake home. 
But where would you put these outside? Well, I, my mom, I know, uses on, on both of her shed doors in the back shed. A lot of people have those, those blank wall spaces, whether you have stucco or you have, or you have just a, a large amount of fence area in your backyard mm -hmm. that you can put these on. It's just, I know my son loves, he tours around our house every day and we see all the different figurines, all the uh, different animals. How old is your son? He's two. He just turned two on Memorial Lindsay's Day weekend. Lindsay's got a two-year-old. I knew yeah. Lindsay when she babysat my kids. <laughs> yes. when they were little. Baby oh, Finnegan. Lindsay's got a two-year-old. That's so awesome. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, these are those things that like your whole family can enjoy. Your, your, your loved ones, if you have grandchildren or if you have your own children, everyone can go look in the backyard and just smile. Last minute, tell me the choices again. Would you please, Lindsay? So we've got our flower, which I've been holding the whole show. We've got our awesome a hummingbird, which is great. Again, has dimension with the two different wings. I love, I love all the colors again with the hummingbird design. And then our classic butterfly, which I actually use on our screen door at home. So butterfly I've used, and I love it. I just think it's, it's just a classic summer piece, and it just makes you smile. Butterfly in the lead, yeah. uh, making you smile. You make us smile. Oh, I love you. A little transition <laughs> there. Uh, always a pleasure. Nice to have you here. So good to see you. Uh, great lady. More to come <laughs> in the show, by the way. It's QVC two. Hey, Energizer's back. Love this item. Do you have this item? You gotta call me. No, you gotta call me. At the phone number that I'll give you right now. If you have M.